Gordon McPhail, Ardmore, matured in sherry casks. It's a lovely colour in this one, and that's down to the sherry casks that we've used. Yeah, European oak um, is a much more open grain. It gives much more colour, more amber. Sherry casks come from uh, predominantly um, the area around Hereth. Sherry is actually the anglicised word for Hereth. Okay, and we've been um, working with sherry bodegas now for a long time, and our history with Boyington Humber goes back a long way as well. We have been working with them since Tony Humbert holidayed in Lost Smelt a few miles away from here and met her grandfather, which gave us great access to um, first full sherry casks. Ardmore, as you know, it means big slope in Gaelic. I didn't actually know that. It was built in 1898 um, and has been producing um, pretty much since then. It's got a fantastic rich nose. Ardmore uses a slight peating, which again is complemented by the European oak and the heavier maturation. So then just in the background there's a wee bit of smoke. It's got a really kind of spicy edge to it. Sweet ripe banana note comes through and that subtle peatiness just lingers in the background. And it's just a, a nice heavy wide script of fireside drum. Yeah, you can just imagine that fire burning and nosing this whiskey.